today we are going to dive into heat pipe condenser economizers with our guest, Dr. Bertrand Delpec. Hi, I'm uh, Dr. Bertrand Delpec. I am uh, working at Bonnell University as a research fellow and I am part of the heat pipe and thermal management research group led by Professor Usam Shah. Why, why do you think, in your own words, why is iWaste important? How is it different from any other project? Well, I, I think our, it's, it's a really important project. Uh, first, uh, because of the water, the water usage that are generated by the industry, which is quite a large amount. And uh, if we can manage to reduce that, um, it will be more It will be really beneficial that as uh, we we are we're starting to have summers that are quite hot, and we have lots of time. We have droughts uh, in different countries, especially in the southern country like Italy or where we where we're trying to install this unit and southern country as Spain as well. So it, it is really crucial to, to be able to recover as much water as we can to reduce uh, the, the amount of water usage. Um, and also one of the other benefits uh, in this project is uh, by recovering this heat from the exhaust, uh, we are really trying to take down the temperature to really low temperature. So we are looking at maybe exhaust temperature at, instead of 150 degrees, maybe at 60 or 50 degree, which is quite substantial. And that will allow us to reduce the energy consumption of the plant and reduce the CO2 emission that they will generate. Uh, one of the last, uh, one of the last uh, benefits, let's say, is also by reducing the exhaust, you can condense also some of the harmful components that are at the moment rejected because there is no choice. Sure. And why is Brunel University London interested in a project like iWaze? First, it allows us uh, to take some uh, young PhD students and allow them to, um, to evolve over the years of the project, get more confident about their work and also uh, improve their PhDs and things like that, allow them to have an actual demonstration where they can validate their, tech their, their ideas and their thoughts uh, and also the test rig that they're building in the Brunel, then they can be applied in, the, in a real industrial sector and that has a huge value for them, but also for Brunel because that allows them to have a really good dissemination. This is one of the, one of the important things. Um, also, uh, it's because we believe that the heat pipe technology uh, is need, need to be developed because we think that it can be part of, of a better solution for energy efficiency than conventional heat exchanges because they, they can last longer, they're, they're, they're better built, and they can manage much, much, different, much more different uh, exhaust than the, current, than the current technology of conventional shell and tube, let's say, that are used at the moment. And, uh, and yes, it's really also for Bonnell to be able to, to be working with so much different partners, uh, and that allows us also to develop really our technology, but also our, our skills within the team, because working with so many different partners, that allow them really to work in really different areas that we were not anticipating to work in, really. So like in control, decision support system, uh, communications, all these things that what our team was not really skillful in, uh, we are building up our skills thanks to this project. The, the, the This group that was created by Professor Sam, I think, has a will be will be staying for quite a long time because the heat pipe technology is so broad and the application that we did ourselves on on the group was ranging from temperatures of minus 120 degree all the way up to 600 degree almost 1000 degree sometime so that's why the application is very broad and uh, there is plenty of room for research on the heat pipe exchanger perfect and uh, what is what is that do you have in your in your background it's a model of a heat pipe heat exchanger yeah. it's actually a, a model i've built with professor sam uh, six years ago when i did my first three months placement uh, in brunel so it's, a, it's 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 just a demonstration it's not it's not functional but uh it's to allow you to see all the heat pipes and the staggered arrangement in the heat pipe so that's what we call the uh, a multi-pass heat exchanger that we use uh, we use when we don't want to condense the exhaust. So that's not that's the opposite of highway basically. <laughs>
thank you, Dr. Del Pesh, for being here, and thank you for, for sharing your experience with us. You're more than welcome.